welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome and if you're back kisses my name is rosie for short and today i want to share this video with you guys with interesting things about beauty items that i use and they might look strange or different and they may not be so common and i got inspired to make this video because I was using one of these and when my boyfriend saw me using it, he was like, what is that? What is that for? He had no idea. And maybe some of these things you have seen before, but I thought it would be something fun to share. So without talking anymore, let's begin. The first thing that I have is this. Do you know what this is for? I'm gonna give you a couple of seconds to try to guess and basically this clip is for the nose yes so you clip it here like that and basically the idea is that it will give you a thinner nose and what I like to do I like to put this on when I don't have makeup because I don't want to get the white area dirty so i either use it in the morning or at night time and you're supposed to use this every single day for at least 30 days or a few weeks to actually see results i'm not good at that i use it every often and i bought it because i have a small bump on my nose I don't know if you get to see that and I got it because I thought oh I just want to have my straight nose like when I turn sideways I want my profile my nose to look straight with no bump so that that was my idea so that's why I got this but I also noticed that on the days that I suffer with a lot of allergies when it is non-stop and I'm sneezing and I have a runny nose all I have to do is put this on and for some reason it stops my allergies it is wonderful it is not meant for that but this little thing helps with allergies too and i just love using this i apply it for about 15 seconds the recommended time is between 10 and 15 seconds so the first few minutes you won't feel anything but after a few minutes it Kind of starts feeling uncomfortable like you just want to take it off that's how it feels it's something cute and different i don't know if you already knew about this or is it something new that you were seeing i would love to know if you have seen this before or any of the other items i'm going to be sharing let me know in the comment section okay next thing is this right here and it's something that you can bend and it's made of metal so do you know what this is <laughs> so if you haven't seen this before this is a tongue scraper so basically <laughs> you would just scrape your tongue so this is just basically to get rid of the residue that is left on your tongue and this is something that you can use every few days or maybe every day if you like and basically this is one so that you don't create bad breath and two you don't want that residue to stay on your tongue that can go into your stomach and be bad for the health so that's why i got it um to be honest i don't see a lot of residue when i scrape my tongue and i think that's because when i brush my teeth in the morning and night with my bamboo toothbrush i always brush my tongue as well so i not only my teeth but my tongue as well and then i would just scrape my tongue with this and you're supposed to see like a white gunk come out so it's kind of gross but it cleans the tongue so um it's like a nice feeling it's like you're massaging your tongue it's something different and i like it <laughs> the next item is this right here do you know what this is for <laughs> it's something that you can bend and again this is made of metal and in case you're not familiar with this this is to remove hair so <laughs> basically you use it with two hands you place it on your skin and you would just roll it so just make sure it's going through your skin 
and you can use this on your lip area or your cheeks wherever you want to get rid of hair and that's what it's basically for just in case you just want to get rid of hair and you want to have a smooth skin that way your makeup application stays on longer so that might help with that um i also tried this on my arm but it doesn't do much of a good work because i'm using just one hand so i guess the idea is is to use it with two hands leave a few inches in between and you just roll it on your face to make it work <laughs> okay the next item and i feel like this is more popular like i think more people know about this now so this is a roller and on the roller there are a lot of pointed and so they're like needles do you know what this is for hmm <laughs> So in case you don't know what this is for, this is for the face and basically it's to get rid of wrinkles or to prevent wrinkles from forming. So the idea behind it is that you roll it on your skin and because it has a lot of needles, it's kind of like telling your skin create new skin. It's like when you get a tattoo, those are like needles pinching your skin and you will see or you will notice that you will never get any type of acne in case you have it on your face or your back wherever it is so this is the same idea that when you roll it on your skin on that affected area it will create new skin so it won't form new acne and it will make like a tighter skin so that's what it's for and basically I don't use it as often because I feel like it hurts so much. I see tears coming out of my eyes from the pain. But I've seen some people use eyes before they apply this and that makes it work. You can use this twice a week or once a week and that way you can see the results and just have a smooth and tight skin with this. <laughs> okay and the last thing is this right here do you know what this is for so this came as a set and this is like a little clip so if you don't know what this is for this is to apply eyelashes so what you do you apply the glue on one of the ends on one of the edges you apply the lash and then with the clip you grab it and you apply it onto your eye <laughs> this is to make it more easier for people who are just getting into eyelashes or you just want a different form of applying your eyelashes to be honest i'm at the point where i don't know what works best for me i know some ladies they use their fingers i know other people use tweezers and any way that i try i always have kind of a hard time applying eyelashes because it's something that i don't do often um so it's something that i like to apply every often but either way it's just something that i still have to practice and that's why i got this but i still have a hard time applying eyelashes whichever way that i try to do it <laughs> so that's it you guys I thought it would be fun to share everything that I have. I still have more things, so in case you want me to do something similar to this video or buy new things to share that are weird or strange, then let me know in the comments section and I would love to make another video for you. If you have liked this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you knew about these items or are they new to you. Let me know and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Mwah, mwah. Kisses. Bye. What were you asking? That what is this for? It looks strange. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a snake. That's bothering Take a guess. What do you think it's for? Um, curling your hair up. <laughs> no. That is for your face to get rid of hairs. Can I try it on you? Yeah. I can? Yes. It's going to hurt. Soft. Okay, let's try it on your arm.
Okay. Is it gonna make you relax? I don't know. Let's see. Did tell you me try what it, it? feels. Yeah. Tell me what you feel. You you hold it with two hands. Uh, and, and then, then roll it. Yeah. It feels soft. It's relaxing me. It's hurting my hairs, but it doesn't <laughs> matter. <laughs> it's, it's pulling the hairs. That's what it does? Yeah, it gets rid of the hair. Oh. What do you think? Did it hurt? No. <laughs> How did you know that? Because you told me before. Oh, okay. <laughs> and this? What do you think that is for? I don't know. That's for your tongue, to scrape your tongue. How do you scrape it? And uh, take out your tongue and scrape it. Like this, but how which way like this? Yep. <laughs> it's like it's brushing its hair. <laughs> Next one. What do you think this is for? The eyelashes. This one. That's what I was saying, the eyelashes. Oh, no, be careful. You see this? It has a lot of needles or pointed little ends. You have to be hurt. careful. They don't hurt if you touch them soft. Yeah. What are these for? For the face. Again, let me use them for my cheeks. Uh, it might hurt. It doesn't hurt. If you do it hard, it will hurt because it's needles. I've done it before and... It makes me cry from the pain. Looks like a fidget spinner almost.